right here we are is uh, a bit of a slight wind but it's not meant to be here so uh, we're actually at Tayport uh, I'm fishing with cat today and hopefully she's not going to outfish me uh, <laughs> so here we are uh, hopefully catch uh, flounders maybe a uh, place a uh, dab Possibly trout, and I've heard that there's bass getting caught here as well. There's a guy caught a couple couple of days ago, so there's quite a variety to catch, catch here. This place can be good or it can be bad. This pier, uh, you're actually better fishing up in amongst the rocks up there, but uh, we're we're here just now. So we'll see what we can do. Uh, Weather-wise, it's meant to meant to be calm, light winds. It doesn't feel like it. Maybe once the tide comes in, the wind will die down, I hope. Uh, it'll make for a bad video of it, isn't it? And, uh, well, we're using bait. We've got mackerel. Uh, we've got bluey standards. I, I should have actually went and dug worms. I had time earlier this morning to do it, but... Oh. So I brought some sand eels. Just have a go and uh, black lug. Still frozen. Crabby creatures. Yes, lovely crabby creatures. And that's our bait. Uh, it's about half an hour till low tide. And the tide's quite a bit out. So we'll have to wait a wee while for the water to come in a wee bit. But, uh, apart from that, it's fine. Looks like an alligator in the, vo in the water. It's a log. Nah. Uh, yeah. So the sun's meant to be out all day. Uh, hopefully the jet skiers will keep away from here. I've seen a lot of them up the uh, riverside and down Broughty and that like so hopefully they'll stay away from here. Uh, only bother might be yachts and canoeists. But that'll not be for another two or three hours into the tide, so we'll see. And it's quiet just now, nobody else down fishing, but I'm expecting a few later. Because I think it was last week when we come over, there was quite a few fishing. Uh, nobody was catching, but there was quite a few fishing, so... I'm down here to prove there's fish. Well, that's the aim. So, we'll, we'll get bait up, but uh, not for a wee while. And I'll get a look around and let you see the, the joys that Tapor have. Uh, they've got coffee that's shot. <laughs> Doesn't help. And we're straight across the road from the uh, Broughty Ferry Castle. And I'm living in hope that the amphibians don't have a swimathon. One time before I was over here and I actually swam from Broughty Ferry across to here. And the place was rocking with swimmers and that. So, looking for a quiet day. So, I'll we'll have a wee look around in a little while. Right, this is a uh, it's low tide now. Uh, it's a bit of a cast into the water, but I'm going to go go anyway. And this wind is still cu cutting across. I hope it isn't interfering too much with us. Uh, Cat, I think I'll wait till I'll wait till the water comes in a bit before I put her out. Well, just now anyway. She's sitting reading the book on fishes, so if she's looking at all the things she can catch. <laughs> Good luck on that one. So we'll, we'll get cast out and see how we do anyway.
I don't normally get good water. I didn't think it was good. Hey, that's me in the water. The first with the Sonic 14 footers, Abu 65 CT Mag. Hey, uh, no Mag CT. Thing. Uh, just using two hook uh, one o pattern roster, and a uh, cat's gonna be using the same with a uh, four ounce weight. She's using my uh, my boat rod, my Abu uh, Uptider, and uh, I've got got her a smaller reel, all black sixty, I think it is. Yeah, I've never used the reel. I got it, but I've never used it. Fixed spool, twin handles. Yeah. It's a lot easier for her to wind in and that rather than that other thing because that was loaded with therapy and line. There's a big heavy duty reel that's too much. So this should be easier easier when there's a few fishes on it. Hopefully she's got a few fishes on it. So there we go. And she's using the same trace as I am, the two hook uh, one o pattern roster. And uh, we'll see how things go. The tide's still well out, but uh, Shouldn't take long to come in, I hope. And I, I will give you a look round. I'm waiting for this winter to die down a bit. Eh, got a whole family over there having a picnic. How lovely. So let's have a look around. Uh, we're actually fishing on the pier. Uh, there's another pier over there that used, used to have a boat on it. Uh, I take it they must have finished the work on it, whatever. A bit and weedy and everything. There was a boy who walked round there earlier on. I'm sure I'm, I'm sure I'm not. Uh, in the back there is Dundee. If it, goes, if it goes down the way, it's a bite. Hopefully. Army military training camp. And we cross the water. And Tensmere, Tensmere Forest in the back there. Uh, Tayport Harbour. I hope you can hear me over this wind. All the boats in the harbour there. There's a little bit of a little picnic over there. Yeah, there's a little, little lift in the ground. They've got a boat of the uh, flowers in it. Uh, there's also toilets in, at the back of here and there's also a lot of bins so there shouldn't be any excuse for having rubbish lying around here. Uh, nice bell up there. And this is Antiport itself. I wonder if our building suffers from damp. It's, it's right on the water. And, uh, yeah. As you can tell, the water's still out quite a bit. Still quite a bit of sand there. But uh, it shouldn't take long to come in, it's five metre tide, so the water should rush in. So we'll get back to the fishing and see what we can catch.
tuk tuang Passing three roads of a one dry boat doesn't work. But there we go. Rather nice size flounder. <coughs> First one of today. Lovely. Oh, I can't make a fish on there. Not something being around anyway. Lift the road up a wee bit though. That's it. It's going off. Is it off? Walk over to the walk over to the wall a bit. You've got a fish on. Wind it, wind it, wind it. Walk over to the wall. Over that way. This way. Over that way. That's it. That's it, keep winding. There you go. <laughs> there you go. There's Cat's <laughs> first flounder. Just a little baby one. It's a flounder. Nice wee flounder there. <laughs> oh, cool. I thought there was something there. Right, that's about four hours we've spent here and we've caught two fish. One for me and one for Kat, and that's me you know, that two flounders uh, give up and move somewhere else, I think. There must be fish elsewhere, because they're certainly not here. See you in a bit, somewhere else. Right, uh, I was just about to let you know that we've now moved to Riverside Drive, and uh, we just got cast in, and well, look what she caught. Nice wee flounder. Aww. Not even in two minutes that she'd come, she come out with a flounder after fishing at Tayport uh, and catching nothing for about four hours. We decided to come over here. We're fishing opposite uh, Tesco, Tesco Extra, uh, about the middle of the Riverside Drive. So we're going to see how things are going to go here. And apparently, looking as if they're going to go rather well for some. <laughs> Just to prove that cat isn't the only one that can catch fish. There you go. There's the flounder. <laughs> She's busy getting bites, I think she may have a fish there right There we go. And you should have the fish on there. Eh? You should have the fish on there. <laughs> nice little flatty, nice little flounder there. Hey, doing well. Is it on? Yeah. <laughs> the red, 
There we go. Another flounder little one covered in seaweed this time. Well, it's a bit of decoration, I think. <laughs> There's Cap, Cap, another one. I'll be this bit of sorting him up my own gear. There we go. Another nice little flounder there. Oops. There you go. Right. <laughs> well, at least like she's in there fish again. Oh yeah, she's catching small fishes. Another little flounder there. <laughs> just a little one, it just looks big because it's close to the screen. Wait a minute. No, it's not because I've got zoom on. There you go. <laughs> this is not fun. Can I fish here? These amateurs are really safe. Crabby creatures. Crabby like Michael. <laughs> ah well. You don't get points for that one. There we go. Just to prove she isn't the only one that can catch fishes. Nice little flounder. Well, there we go. Another, another little flounder. Nice one. Uh, it's, that's just after high tide, so I'm expecting the water to start rushing down the way and pulling out the gear. We'll see how long that, how hard that goes. Uh, if it gets too hard to fish, we'll just give up. But we'll keep at it just now. Just looking at that little bit. Oops. They're flying off. Don't know where they're flying to, but they're flying off. I think there's a fair chance it'll be Montrose Basin, maybe. I don't know if I'm actually getting them on call. Look, there's one going that way. Yeah. I think they're both. <laughs> Here we go, here's our friendly jet skis battering down the river. <coughs> well, they might to keep their distance. But how do they just stay in the middle? Sorry? Why don't they stay in the middle? I don't know, there must be limits. There must be a limit from here out. 
I'm going to get on a paint pin 200 yards out of it. <laughs> I've seen them uh, leaving for a ferry earlier on, but we're at Tipper. There's a gang! Yeah, there's a gang! I've never been out of fun of putting you in that light, Ken. Eh? Oh. Something similar to the motorcycles on, the, on water. Oh, it is just like that. Well, I guess since it was cotton cat's rod, it's cat's fishing. <laughs> there we go, another little flounder. Hey. Yeah. Uh, she's away at the shop, so I guess I guess it's her fish. <laughs> and the way to check is come round here. If it's on record, you'll see a wee red button up there. Oh, yeah. That means it's recording. Okay. If it's green, it's not recording. Just reeling in the gear, last cast, and there we go, a final little flounder. Nice one. Go. I need a comb. Okay. Right, uh, that's just con that, con that quits now. Uh, we're over at the table to start with, with 10 to 1 to 5 o'clock, with only one fish each. Decided to call it, but call it a day. Came over to Riverside, just opposite Tesco's. I been here for what, just just under three hours, and we managed to get the uh, five flounders each, which isn't too bad. Uh, so that means six, six all, six all. So nobody won. Makes a change. <laughs> So, yeah, all in all, good day. The wind was a bit more than I expected, like, it was quite calm days, but it wasn't. It, uh, it was certainly sunny, but not as warm as I was expecting either. So, that's us. I, as you can see, all the gears away, about ready to go home, and uh, going to try Elliot Beach tomorrow. Cat wants to catch a bass. Good luck on that one. <laughs> so we'll head out there tomorrow, uh, LA Beach, and I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, we've already did tomorrow. Tight lines all. <laughs>